Gentlemen, we've been over the rules. Protect yourself at all times. I'm on the fence. I'm on the fence. We don't need to talk about we, 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 we. Left hook from Yaounde came and landed on him, you know, so. And we've obviously got two title, two straps Ooh. on the line in this card. So we've got Valentina Shevchenko. I don't believe I've seen her fight since... Santos. Santos? Yeah. Mm. So it's like a year? Damn. She's giving him a chance to catch up. Is there any point I'm talking about? And then Alexa, <laughs> very, very briefly, come on, put some respect. There's a title in the line, title on the line. Yes. Alexa Grasso, women's flyweight title belt. Like I said, I personally thought Santos beat Shevchenko. Um, that was a crazy decision yeah, in, in, in my yeah. head. It's not but crazy. Or it's not crazy. I show. thought it was crazy. I love Valentina, though. And she's fighting number six, Alexa Grasso. Um, APL's putting himself on the bench again saying no, like, Chewy for, <laughs> a bit like the light heavyweight it's division <laughs> I didn't even put a, <laughs> just going back to our uh, beginning of the year show where APL wasn't president but when we put our picks into who will be champion on the, 30, on the 31st of December 2023 APL was like in terms of light heavyweight nobody cares <laughs> so <laughs> if Alexo Grosso wins nobody cares <laughs> Um, what are you saying, Mardi? Um, yeah, I think I think Valentina will beat her. Um, I've not, to be honest, I've not done my full due diligence on, on Alexa. To be honest, I, I know she's much a good stand up, good, 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 it, good boxing apparently. It's yeah, it's true, and we thought Santos had that as well. To be honest, so I mean, does she have better sta- um, stand up than the people that Valentina was for? Ooh, maybe not. I, I see Valentina winning it, and then I see not looking past Alexa, but got people like Blanchfield like coming mm. through which actually I think maybe causes a bigger threat to Valentina mm. than we've seen in well since we've seen in a long time no we saw it with Santos last year yeah, but we've exactly. seen in a while yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, and that was crazy because Blanchfield was meant to fight Santos and uh, Santos pulled out in fight at the beginning of the fight week with mm. uh, I'm not sure what it was so for me I was really excited about that because I thought whoa that's guaranteed well to be honest I still believe they, you know that's number one contender Mm. Um, in terms of Evan and what she did to oh gosh Andrade oh my gosh yeah. last weekend yeah. I was impressed because yeah, I thought obviously Evan it's going to be on the ground grappling jiu-jitsu blah 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 yo she can fight she can do yeah. stand up she stood with, she stood she with Andrade and, and she took Andrade bang and she yeah. can bang as well so I was like I was yeah. super surprised yeah. Yeah. I was impressed so you know I, you know, I, I agree. I think Valentina, and this can go down with the picks. <laughs> yes. One, one I'm going to win. <laughs> Valentina, don't let me down, yo. <laughs> but, 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 you know, mm-hmm. is Valentina motivated? Yeah. That, that's what that's the get thing. Get yeah. That's what yeah. Get is she focused? Like, if she... That showed in the last fight where, let's be honest, she underestimated Santos. Mm. She must have to a degree because I think Santos had her shell shocked in how she, she went for her. Yeah. Is, is, is it literally now if it's not champ champ status does she even want to fight anyone because she hasn't fought for a year she's just got to be a ballerina but she's got to do something else because what's, the point, what's the point of fighting that's until that's like it. somebody comes up and just like demolishes you and then and it's a sad ending it's like mm. okay if you win win and go out on top and just be known as the you know best women of course obviously she lost she's lost before but mm. just go out on mm. top rather than go out yeah, and losing to like ever. some unknown person that everyone expects you to win against you know what I mean it's true and, she, and she's fighting but a lady yes she's out there but Grasso's ranked number six that's what I mean it's, like, it's, it's got to the point where she's, she's, she's gone through so she's many, doing laps yeah, yeah like, she's, she's yeah. doing laps she's, she's doing, doing laps she's giving chances that's it and then in, <laughs> Santos was number four I think when she fought I, think, her, I believe so yeah, yeah. So that's like the top three and then you've got obviously Valentina oh gosh what a record though nine fight win streak eight wins by knockout seven title defences yeah, she's, it's like, she's levels. I'm not even sleeping on Valentina. Yeah, she nice. is levels. She's too good. Yeah, and she she, she should. I want her to overtake um, Nunes in the amount of title defense she's had in one division. That's what I wanted to do. And she's just beating everyone. When you just look at, I'm just looking at Valentina's records, and like she's the last, the floor with him, last, defe- from the last, one. last defeat, like oh, her records, like literally who's who of women's <laughs> MMA that she has starched. Honestly, I'm not. I'm just looking at it now, and I'm like. She's only, like, I can only see Nunes. losses to Nunes. Nunes. Um, 2016 lost to Nunes. Lost then to she came back, beat Hong. Then she beat Pena. 
then you mean everyone. That's what I'm saying. Who's who? <laughs> 2017, Fort Nunez again lost on a decision, which was very close. Yeah, that was close. Close. That was close. Waterfall. Never heard of her, but she beat Waterfall. Then she beat JJ um, or Joanna. Mm. Then she beat Jessica I. Then she beat Carmouche. Then she, she beat Shukagan. Then she beat Maya. Then she beat Andrade. Um, that's what I'm saying. Women's MMA yeah. history. Yeah. <laughs> then she beat She's Murphy. Then she beat Sa- Santos, controversially. So the only the only risk I can see is, again, similar to John Jones, where the motivation wasn't there at the end of light heavyweight, where she turns up underprepared and then there's going to be a massive shot. But yeah. I think she dictates basically what happens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. she does. For that's sure. Yeah, so... Um, I'll take it all three of us have got Shevchenko even though you don't care Shevchenko <laughs> yeah, I'll watch it though because I like watching oh definitely yeah, going to watch it yeah because she's, she's, uh, she's another one of those goat status type of mm, fighter yeah. so I'll definitely watch it with, with, int- with interest but yeah. I don't expect anything other than I think, I think the, th- the thing is with Valentina I think I put her in that underrated gold status along with Mighty Mouse where mm. when you go back and watch some of the things she does quality of work and you just suddenly yeah, realise yeah, yeah. the technical abilities that they had and they're still evolving and they're trying out new things yeah, all yeah. the time it's actually quite scary yeah. Yeah. honestly yeah. Yeah. so she'll be one that will probably you'll appreciate more yeah. when, so, <laughs> when you, yeah, when you realise honestly yeah, yeah. Um, and then quickly quick mentions obviously we haven't, we haven't done all our, our research on this card but we got Man Light World to Wait Shafkat is fighting Ooh, Jeff Neal. Yeah. Shafkat ranked number seven, Jeff Neal. Sorry, Shafkat number 10, Jeff Neal ranked number seven, well to wait. I'm guessing it's you got Shafkat. He's taking scalps. He's <laughs> taking scalps all the way to the... Heavy favour on the betting as well. Heavy favour. Yeah. Um, and then we Don't got Jaden Turner also in the card fighting uh, Gamot at lightweight. Ah, okay. Because mm-hmm. I'm sure he was supposed to fight um, Dan Hooker. I think Jaden Turner. Yeah, he was. And I was like, Dan, why are you doing this to yourself? <laughs> why, are you do- <laughs> why are you doing this? I know you like to fight anybody anyway, but no. Jaden Turner, is, he's something special. I think that was only... He was meant to fight Dan Hooker, I think, was on the card last weekend. I think that was the one he was, was on. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, then, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. No, no, the the no. Oh, and Dryden. Because in Perth, he was. Oh, in, in, was he meant to fight in Perth? Maybe. Because, yeah. but he had a. Yeah, oh, he tried, had a yeah, cast yeah. in Perth. Maybe that was okay. Yeah, maybe it was Perth. He had a cast on his arm. Yeah, but Perth. he might be right. He might be. He yeah, might yeah. have been on that card just just last weekend yeah. instead. But um, yeah, Jaden Turner. I think he's he's one to watch in that um, light lightweight now, is it? In lightweight, yeah. Lightweight division, and then we yeah. got opening the main card: Bo Nickel versus Jamie Pickett. Okay. Yeah, I like bowls, making a lot of noise noises on socials, so that's gonna yeah. be interesting. And then wow, prelims. Uh Cody Garbrandt. In prelims. In prelims. So Final prelim you. versus uh Trevin Jones. Never heard of Trevin Jones, not gonna lie. But Indeed. what uh, weight is that? That is Bantam weight. Bantam okay, has gone back up, yeah. Yeah. So <laughs> Cody's heavy favourite there. there. Yeah. And then we got another what this is a sleep on the prelims. Derek Bronson versus Drucker's Duplessis. How is he? How are oh, This is a stacked card. Middleweight, stacked five card. versus ten on the prelims. Yo, I'm watching, I'm watching all of this Jeez. live, all of it. Jeez, where did that come from? Yeah, yeah that's, that's a Duplessis. Duplessis. That should be on the main. Why, why is that every not on the main? Day, every day of the week. Wow. That's incredible. That's not even top of the prelims as well. That's like not long ago he was competing for the for number one contender. No, that's interesting, especially after what Duplessis. Yeah, yeah. yeah, especially after what Duplessis did to um uh, Scouser Till. Yeah. <laughs> right. Okay. We're saying this. Uh, uh, what are we saying? Well, I, want, I want some. I want some predictions here. Oh, 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 here we go. I want some uh, predictions. Yeah. See, okay, this is which, your chance. You wasted. You wasted your age or something <laughs> on on Dal. Well, these are the ones. Uh, that you, know what, uh, you know when um. What's his face? Kevin Keegan. Uh, was all, when I love it. I love it. I love it. Go and beat him. I absolutely love it. This is literally me. I love it. Because I, we want to. I want to go back into the tapes and be like, yo, what are you saying, bro? What are you saying? What are you saying? Anyway, um, when do you want us to start with the predictions? All of them. All right, I've got. Okay, I got. Okay, I got Shafkat beating Jeff Neal. Yeah, it's Shafkat. Should I be contrarian? Yeah, do it. <laughs> no, no, I'm sticking. Oh, okay. Please, 
comment, everyone. Comment on your <laughs> picks. On yeah. your picks. And who you feel out of three of us is just a sheep. Yeah. And who's authentically, like, passionately back in their fighters. And, and who's intelligent. <laughs> <laughs> who has serious yeah. fight IQ. Uh, who Come on, God. Don't let me down, bro. <laughs> don't let me down. <laughs> and then Gamwat versus Jalen Turner. Gamwat, so, uh, you know what? I'm going Gamwat. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm going Gamwat. Gamwat's like Gamwat, Gamwat, serious, you know. Jalen. Jalen, yeah, trust me. Right. Jalen's coming for that, mate. All right. Division. Fairly, we've got Bo Nickel, Jamie Pickett. Oh, I thought it was, thought it was a different Jamie Pickett I had in my head. Yeah, I thought it was the, the UK know, guy. Um, just, yeah, just because I know jo- Bo Nickel is a monster wrestler, I'm going to go Bo Nickel. I don't know his opponent. I don't know, so I'd, I'd be picking just on... Not on a name, yeah. I can't, yeah, I can't, I can't pick on that one to yeah. be honest. So, you might get a bonus point. Yeah, I get a flip, bonus flip, point. Flip, like, you know, yeah, so, so, yeah, so, you get a bonus ask, one. Ask me first, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know either. I didn't actually say Marty, I just put, it, put the name that's out there. You went and true. jumped on it, mate. Do you want to go back and go? That's a that's a void for us. That's a fight we just enjoy. No, I want to go bonus right, points. I don't, bonus. Know, I don't know. Pick but but, but if you lose, does it mean a minus? Yeah, it means a minus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It a yeah it's a yeah. bonus point. You're making oh, a risk. Minus, yeah, yeah. got to be. To be honest, I can afford to lose. Bonus. Replay. No lie. You know me. And then we got Breeders. Like I said, we got Cody Goldbrand versus Trevin. Trevin Jones, Bantamweight. God, I've run up to these days, man. Yeah. I'm you know, on this one. I don't know this one. To be honest, that, that was telling you about what Cody training in um, Dubai oh, with yeah. Hamzat, getting at like getting beat up basically, but in a good way. Like it would yeah. probably make him tougher because they were going in, like they were sparring, but it looked like full contact sparring, yeah. black eyes, bust lips. Well, it's good for him because he gets <laughs> slipped every day. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> It's an element of that. It's an element of that as well, like where his CT is on, you That's know, even saying. more wobble, 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 wobble. CT battery. Oh on low gosh. Battery. Yeah, I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Trevin. I don't know him, but you know, I think Cardi, Colt Cardi, <laughs> Cardi B. <laughs> <laughs> Cardi Colt. <laughs> Cardi, I mean, Cardi, uh, I mean Co- Cody. Obviously, the slide is is a deep one, yeah. and um, yeah, I can't I can't disagree with you. But you know what? Because he's iron sharp as iron. And now I'm going Trevor. Now nah, nah, I'm even gonna fake it. Now I'm gonna stick. I'm gonna stick with Cody, man. You're going with Cody. Just for all time sake, because I think I don't know what this guy is. Um, I don't know what his record is like or whatever. But That's for all time sake, I think Cody needs to uh, needs to get a W. He's on a losing streak, no? Cody, yeah. yeah. He's not won He's in a while. <laughs> was I'm it against at, that? I'm looking at Trev's. Tre- I'm going to call him Trev. 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 Oh, do you no, know like that? Oh, no, yeah. I don't really like his record either. Yeah, it's I'm not, going Cody on this one. Trevin, Trevin's got 13 wins, 9 defeats. Oh, gosh. Yeah. Might not be. What's Cody saying? Yeah, what's his losing streak like? Oh, is it 2 or 3? Cody's currently lost, lost to Kai. Yeah. Kai Kyle of France, but that was a different division, remember? Yeah, yeah, but it's still And then yeah. lost to Font. Yeah. And then beat Ashton Shao. Oh, yeah, that was that yeah. when you loaded up. So he mm. held on B and X. Yeah. And <laughs> but he has a, uh, oh, he, that's, that's his own, But that's his only win in his last one, two, he's, three, yeah, four, five. Spiral. That's his only win in his last six. He's on a downward spiral, but still. Like, that's your boy, right? <laughs> that's your boy. That, that, what, sticking. Cardi? Cardi's not my boy. You picked Cardi, you Cardi no? <laughs> Man, I picked Trevor. Oh, but then I saw Cardi. Trevor's record. I'm, Do you know what? I'm out. I don't care. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. I don't care. Cardi. You're picking Cardi. Yeah. Cardi! Cardi! <laughs> Yeah. So, so I'm out on that one. For all time's sake. For all yeah. time's sake. If he loses, the UFC better just rip up his contract and just tell him to. Yeah, send him packing. Yeah. Oh, I'll I'll learn, Hopefully you, you learnt something in the bar anyway. Um, Derek Bunsen versus Duplessis. Ooh. Middleweight. Now, now, now. What? Okay, what's Bunsen? Who's the last fight? Was it the last two? Was it the last two? Um, what's his face? Cannonier lost. Yeah. Before that, he beat Till as well. Before that, he beat Holland. Yeah. Everyone beats Till these days, man. True that. Um, true that, true ooh. that, true that. I'm going with him. Duplessis does get it yeah. done. Duplessis, he looks strong against Till. And again, everybody looks strong against Till. <laughs> but it's going to be who's got the better wrestling. And I think maybe mm. the momentum 
is on Deep Seas, and Deep Seas got better strike in the Brunson. Can Brunson pick up that momentum again? I don't know, you know. I'm with Lucas, man. I'm with Deep Seas. After what he did against Till, he absolutely manhandled him. Made it look. Mm. Um, again, like you said, it, it seems to be a winning theme, but. And they've both beaten Till, actually. Um, I'm going to do Pussies. Oh, man. Why are you being whipping, boy? <laughs> we had high up, but I had high up for them. Um, on this one, who am I going for? Are you both going for what? You know what? Yeah, I'm going to be contrary here. I'm going for Brunton. Nice. Yeah, I'm going for Brunton. It's the favourite. He's nice. Not. Lock it in, people. And then, uh, this is not financial advice. <laughs> and then, I'm not, I don't think we should do picks for the next nah, one. Yeah, but no, we've no, got Vivian Awa Zhao versus Amanda Rebas. Um, uh, women's flyweight belt. And then Julian, Julian Marquez versus Mark Andre Barry out. Middleweight belt, and then who else we got on the card for just uh, honourable mentions? Ian Gary's on the card. Ian Gary, come on, shout out on the prelims. Whoop, whoop. Je- Jessica Pena is on the card. Wow, old school. She's still going. Women's yeah, strawweight. And yeah, that that will be the honourable shout outs. All done. That's a sick card, by the way. You know what? All of it's, a it's a good card. It's a solid card. It's a good card, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Cool. So UFC two eight five review show. Hopefully we'll be back. We'll be back we'll be, to, we'll have to be okay. Back. We'll be yeah. okay. We'll we'll have, we'll compulsory. Have to be back. We might not be back if John Jones loses. Then I don't get to <laughs> marinate in the winning we juices. Might <laughs> it might be a one man show. <laughs> They're calling sick. Hey. <laughs> it's just me in the car on teams <laughs> chatting to you lot. <laughs> But yo, definitely get in the comments who have you got, yes. what round, how, yes, like, please. subscribe. King's Court MMA, we're doing bits. Um, we've got Yaya Rodriguez, into and champ in the world, in the story, viewing it, <laughs> in the DMs, <laughs> in my DMs, in our DMs. Yo, uh... guests are coming. We've got some more guests, future guests. Hopefully you enjoyed um, Haddy on the show a few weeks ago. Yeah. Uh, love to Haddy. Um, obviously, you got APL out of the slumber, so Haddy, we appreciate you. <laughs> whatever, man, whatever you <laughs> <laughs> APL versus Haddy next. <laughs> okay, <then>. UFC <laughs> 300. <laughs> it's going to be big. <laughs> He's already been training, Haddy. He better get in the gym. <laughs> but, yo, love. Uh, subscribe, like, tell your friends about us. Kings Court MMA. That's this it. has been the UFC 285 preview show. John versus Garm. Cannot wait. That's Support it. your boy Oba, Soggy. It's your guy Marty. APL. Oba and out, people. Boom. All right, gentlemen, we've been over the rules. Protect yourself at all times. On the fence. I'm on the fence. That's it. We don't need to talk about it. We, 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 we Left hook from Yaounde came and landed on him, you know, so.